Hello. Well, I'm here, and I have my other hat on, just for variety. Plus, I already have a Star Wars shirt on. So, there you go. There's my Star Wars sort of quote, I guess, for the video, plus the calendar. Um, but, yeah, all that aside, um, as I have mentioned, like, probably once before, I enjoy Breaking Bad. I enjoy Better Call Saul. I have the complete series of Breaking Bad on DVD. Hope to get the complete series on Blu-ray sometime. However, the version I want is um, a bit pricey. So, needless to say, I have never gotten that. Uh, also, there's a bonus disc on there with stuff that you can never get on the other complete series set. Hence why I want that version. And I have all the seasons of Better Call Saul on Blu-ray at the moment, so. Yeah, I'm a fan of the, those shows, the franchise. Um, and I'm planning to make this video as short as possible. Um, because, you know, and spo might be, maybe spoilers for anybody who has never seen the show, Breaking Bad in particular, because Better Call Saul is a prequel. Um, though at the beginning of every season there's a flash forward of where the character of, of Saul Goodman is now after Breaking Bad so spoiler alert there for those who have never seen it he lives because uh, Breaking Bad there's a lot of killing and violence that goes on in that show and again it's about chemistry teacher turned drug maker makes crystal meth and makes like the purest meth ever and it's blue so um you know Walter White and uh Jesse Pinkman as partner you know if you've seen the show you know all what happens but uh, and you know and I'm talking about this because of a trailer that has come out, uh, and uh, it's about the Breaking Bad movie, which was a complete secret until like last year. I guess even before then, there was rumors and rumblings for about the tenth anniversary, because last year was the tenth anniversary of the show. Um, in fact, I might have made a, another video, honestly, about that. If not, well, whoops, my bad. I probably just showed enthusiasm online. But anyway, that doesn't matter, I guess, now. It's too late. But, um, the, the for the 10th anniversary, they were going to do something quite special. But that whole year came and went with nothing. But it was later in confirmed last year by Brian Cranston there was a movie in the works it was already being made as they were speaking and uh, we got a trailer as of the recording of this now a few days ago by the time you see this it'll be almost like a week or so uh, about a week since that trailer dropped so yeah I record again. I record all these way in advance because they all come out on Friday. Because that's what I want. I want to be consistently upload a video every Friday just because I want to be consistent. At what is this? This needs to leave and never return. All right. So the trailer for the movie has Skinny Pete, and he's talking to the police, probably DEA agents, whatever. And, uh, you know, he's talking, and basically, he has no clue where Jesse Pinkman is. And if he did, he would not be telling them. Uh, especially, like, you know, hearing all the stuff they did to him to keep, make him keep cooking. He's not going to tell him a single thing if he knew where he was. But, uh, and, uh, you know, Skinny Pete was one of Jesse's friends. I wonder if Badger will show up. Um, you know, the movie is called El Camino, 
even though it was the Greenbrier was the uh, working title or fake title, whatever you want to call that. And it is coming out October 11th of this year on Netflix uh, and then on AMC uh, at a later date. AMC will have it. I would imagine they would also probably have like a marathon of Breaking Bad just before they showed uh, El Camino. And for those who don't know what the title is referring to, it's referring to uh, 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 the car Jesse took at the end of the show when he escapes from the neo-Nazi place. You know, they... Uh, Apologies there, that was frightening. Uh, but yeah, he took an El Camino car. And yeah. This camera is weird. But anyway, uh, the show will just follow what happens with Jesse after he escaped. and Because, you know, uh, Vince Gilligan, the creator, executive producer, and writer and director of many of the episodes has often said he believes Jesse had a good life. And, you know, he... Because uh, he went through so much abuse on the show. If there's any character who deserves to have a great life, it's him. Um, and, of course, you know, there's uh, Walter White's kids. His kids. Um, but, yeah... It's, I don't know, the trailer looks really, it makes you have interest. It's just a teaser, but it makes you really interested in this. And um, if you're a fan of the show, if you've never seen this show, I think you should watch it. And then watch Better Call Saul also. I don't know what I would say is better. Um, I think I might be inclined to say Better Call Saul is better, but then again, it's still on. We're still seeing how all of this comes about. For me, though, I'm going to watch both shows again back to back, and also probably the movie. You know, since I'll be out once Better Call Saul is said and done, and I'll watch them all and just see which do I think is better. Um, yeah, maybe that's why I've also hold, held off on actually talking about the show because you know. Prequel still going, and yeah, uh, yeah. That's really all I have to say. Apologies for the camera being a bit wonky again. It's like that sometimes. Sometimes it's not. I do settings and stuff, but I don't know. It seems like to do what it wants. Um, you know, no. <laughs> it's one of those things. You have it set a certain way, but then it'll just do whatever sometimes things like that get out of your control and I'd have to do something again uh, yeah. but anyway uh, that's all I have to say uh, are you a fan of Breaking Bad better call Saul are you excited are you not excited do you think this was a bad idea they should have just left the series alone you know I mean aside from better call Saul like, there should never have been a movie. Do you even care what happened to Jesse? All that stuff. You can leave your thoughts if you want. Or you don't. Whatever. Or are you not a Breaking Bad fan? You just happen to come across this video. Maybe you're subscribed to my channel and saw this. Um, yeah. I don't know. Regardless, I hope you all have a good day. I hope you have a good weekend and a good week. And I'll see you next time.